Guys, I told my buddy that I joined a male escort service and I used his phone number on the form. So we're pranking him. He thinks he's my pimp now and I'm having different friends call him as he tries to negotiate my rates. Check this out. Hi, I'm calling about an ad I saw online. Oh yeah, you just called you call the right person. Oh, I did. Is this Little John? This is this is not Little John, but I, I act as Little John's secretary. Oh, <laughs> the ad said he's like cute and he's smart and he's got muscles and he's a college graduate and I just wanted to check on his rates. Um, he's a stud, by the way. I'm his friend. I know this. Um, his rates are uh. Four to six hundred dollars. Four to six hundred? Yes. And, and that's not including um, flight and hotel. Okay, and what's his availability? Oh, no, sorry, 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 sorry. The standard rate is like, can we read this? Okay. Two hundred to five hundred. So, yeah, so what do you get yeah. for two hundred versus five hundred? Um, that's a good question. Um, well, he's definitely chaperoning you to a wedding, is that how it goes? What's that? You need the chaperone for a wedding? How do you, hold on. Well, I was thinking of maybe a weekend. For a weekend? Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, look, I'll, I'll tell you what, what are the questions, um, what do you need me to do and I'll relay this message back to him and I'll call you a little bit is that okay yeah that's fine i just want um his rates what's included and availability okay great let me go ahead and give him a call real quick and i'll call you right back okay? perfect thank you okay all right bye Literally. hello i'm calling for little john what's up with the secretary brad i need a escort to come with me to a couple of parties um over in Miami, and um, I know he says he's straight, but you know, sometimes you never know um, what exactly they're looking for. It's expensive if he's, if he's going to do this, and it's going to be from $3,000 to five. Oh, 3000 for the weekend? That's not too bad. You know, obviously, I think one of the things is it said that he's very athletic. Um, does he okay. have an athletic body, and does he have a smooth body? When I'm saying smooth, I mean by, you know, not a lot of body hair, rather rather slender looking. Very slender, yes. Yes, I think he shaves. He's a swimmer, too. Oh, that's yes. that's exactly what, what I'm looking for. Uh, I'll call you back, okay? Great, thank you. Can you hear me? This is Detective Sandoval. You're not in any trouble yet, but we've been cracking down on a lot of these escort sites, and I uh, want you to understand that. Our oh, what? Who? What? This, this is Detective Sandoval. Wait, wait, hold our investigation led okay. us to you and it indicates that you're one of the busier people on, on there lately. What can you tell us about this little John? I'm sorry, I couldn't. You're getting cut off here. In investigator Detective Sandoval about little John. Cracking down on a lot of these escort sites. Want to know what your involvement is? This business is out of Florida, but you operate it out of the West, so you are coast to coast, correct? You're getting cut off here. You have the wrong number, sir. Are you sure? Yeah. Do you re do you realize I have your phone number? You realize you've oh, I already have your home address on St. Louis did, Street in Long how Beach. How did you get my phone number? How did you get my my address? So, are you are you are you not involved with Little John? Who is this? Are you are you not involved with Little John? No. Um. Well, it's led directly to you. No, I'm not involved with anybody named Little John. Little John. Are you sure? Because you've received money for sex. We have that track to you. All this stuff is, is this? done digitally that we can track. Who is this? We'll, we'll send someone down in Long Beach. We'll do a door-to-door -door hey, investigation wait. for you because if you want to not cooperate now, we'll make sure that you end up cooperating. Yo, don't answer shit, man. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to contact my buddy. He's an FBI. Dude, you're in big trouble right now because you accepted the PayPal. I didn't accept shit. They have it all on file, man. I'm in the I'm in the office right now. Suck my fucking dick. I didn't accept any kind of fucking money from nobody. Basically, because we're working coast to coast, we're in a lot of trouble because it's like across FBI lines. Whatever it is, I didn't fucking accept any money from nobody. So. <laughs> It's 
my birthday prank for you, say. You, I knew it, you motherfucker. <laughs> Asshole, you. <laughs> Were you freaked out for real? Yeah, I would fucking get my mom's address, but I'm like, okay, hold on a second. Who knows my fucking mom's address besides a handful of people? You fucking... Yeah, you, you would, yeah, I gave you fucking mom's address, so I would mem memorize that shit. <laughs> you asshole, dude, fuck! Jesus, wait, wait, hold on a second, so this whole thing was a fucking prank, you set me up this whole time? Yeah, I'm not on a dating service, and I'm not a uh, escort. Who are those people that call me? I don't, those are just all friends of mine. This is a lack of prank, this is from last week, motherfucker. Yeah, this is a five day long prank. Oh man, you got me, you got this, oh man. I wanted you to think you were becoming a pimp, and, and slowly get into that world, and you know, get really excited about making the money. That, that was pimp. fun, man, <laughs> I thought it was fun, I'm like, first, fuck you dude, I can't believe you gave up my fucking cell phone number. <laughs> and then, I'm at home watching the HBO, and then this girl calls, and I'm like, fuck, this kind of cute. You slowly became a pimp, like against your will, and you got good at it. And then the police came and cracked down on you a week later as one of the busier. But, but I saw your photo on that website, so that was Photoshop. Photoshop. Are you serious? Yeah. Oh my God, you got me. That's off to you. So you never fucking apply for. There's no dating site that does this. No, I am currently a comedian only. You're a goddamn. You know what? You're probably lying to me right now. Oh my damn. God. Damn, damn, damn. That was a. That's a good one, man. That's a good one. But the thing was, the, the guy, the people that called me, those people actually sounded like genuine people. You know, it's funny, I never ratted you out. You didn't, I, you're, you're a good friend. I want to say, fuck you, Kayvon, because I assumed it was you, but I didn't say Kayvon, you know what I said? I said Kevin. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>